than with fin rats. Whoa. Ooh, sorry. Jeez, Dan. These hips don't lie. All right, boys. It's time for one more video. I didn't film this morning because I was in a bit of a hurry, which is a damn shame because I was hauling ass and it looked so good. Outside, it looks like it may rain, so hopefully we don't get caught up in that shit. If we do, I guess... Uh, uh, I'll probably just turn off my um, my GoPro because I have a hole drilled in the case for the waterproofness and it's right there by my mic and I'm already having issues with my mic and I don't want to have to deal with that so that will be the end of the vlog but I don't think we have to worry about that I honestly think that we're gonna make it uh. all right I don't know, it looks good over there. Not so much over there. I guess we'll see. Oh man, I didn't even turn my music on. I wonder if I could just push the play button on my headphones. Oh, it worked! <laughs> Alright boys, let's cross our fingers that no bees hit us today. It's just fun, you know what I'm saying? Like, I've rode my brother's S1000RR, and it's fun, don't get me wrong. It's just, it's not as intense as a 600, you know what I mean? The 600, if you're, if you're going, you're fucking, it seems like the most intense thing in the world. So I don't think I'd ever sell this bike. Like, I, I plan on getting an H2 one day eventually, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I, when I can afford it, so hopefully when I'm done with school, and get a decent job but even once I get that I'm, I'm there's no way I'm selling this bike like this I'm gonna keep this bike until she blows up dude 600s are just way too much fun but, I mean realistically when am I ever gonna get the chance to completely open up an H2 maybe three or four times the entire time I own it I mean I don't know I've never really driven one so I don't know but like I said before, I just love this bike so much, there's no way I could part with it. Unless I absolutely had to, like I had no other option. And maybe it's because it's my first bike, maybe it's just because it's genuinely a good bike. But, whatever the reason, I just don't want to part with it. And I do still want to make a video about the mods on this bike, it's just that... I want to get a camera for school that's a D that's a good camera, you know what I mean? I want to get a DSLR that's got a good video quality because I already got a camera that can take decent pictures and it's also a DSLR but it only has 720p um, video quality so I'm going to wait until I get a new camera and then I'll go from there. Just the exhaust alone on this bike is enough to fall in love with it. Like you can hear my exhaust so so good like you can hear it plain as day on the mic like can you tell that it's kind of hard there's not a shitload of wind noise it's mainly just my exhaust like when you hear in previous videos I've had there's been parts where it's almost like the audio is cutting out or it's like kind of choppy or it's, it's like staticky that's because of my exhaust not because of the winds but the exhaust because I have a a, a drift mic with a wind muff that I put on it. So the wind isn't too bad, but the exhaust is just so loud that it's I mean, like other moto vloggers, you can't hear their exhaust as much as you can hear mine. And I want to get a, a chin, a chin curtain for this helmet and see if that helps at all. But realistically, it's just deafening loud. Like I generally ride with music, and even 
turn over my music, I can hear my exhaust. And I have it not turned up all the way, but maybe three clicks down, you know, enough that it's gonna damage my hearing after so long. Dude, I love how this ride is just so wide open, like there's no cars, no trucks, no nothing. But yeah, the exhaust, I'm sure if you've seen any of my other videos, you would already know what kind of exhaust I got, or I'm sure even in this video, it'll probably show up at the end of the video, but still, it's, it's an exhaust that I want to go over. But there's much more done to this bike than just the exhaust, don't get me wrong. I don't know what you're mowing, buddy, but it smells good. Yeah, there's certain aspects of a 600 you just can't be. You know, like, it just seems so real when you're only going, you know, 130, 140. I mean, that seems really fast, but realistically, there's bikes that can go so much faster. And 120, 140 is just a cruise. Which on this bike, 120, 140 seems like faster than the speed of light, you know what I'm saying? Like, it seems like it's just almost too much. Whoa, there's a car behind me, I didn't even notice. Nah, that was a terrible downshift. <laughs> oh. Dude. Should I just cut in front of this guy? No, I'm gonna smoke his ass once we turn. And it's a woman. Look, lady, I'll show you. I'll show you how to get in front of somebody. Okay, just give me a second here, and I'll, I'll show you the ways. That's how it's done, right there, lady. Woo! Gosners, you guys are starting it off early this morning, huh? It smells real terrible right about now. Dude, I've been listening to like some sort of Matrix song the whole way here. <laughs> Honestly, I don't mind it though. But it is, it's like something straight out of the straight out of the Matrix. It's awesome. Yep. Yeah. Alright, I will see you guys right now. Alright you guys. I'm back. Got done with that. Whew. Oh Jesus. Now it's time to go! Oh boy! Oh Jesus Christ! Oh my God! What a day, huh? I mean, all you guys see me do is riding. God, I really wish that's all I did. Oh, she needs to be clean. Poor baby. I'll take care of you. Just give me some time. Okay. Let's go. I thought I'd seen a motorcycle up here. Dang, either this guy on the motorcycle's getting it or there is no guy. <laughs> Cause I can't see him. He must have either took off or there is nobody there. I could have swore I seen somebody though. He like turned into the passing lane to like let people pass him. What kind of bullshit is that? Holy shit, look at this guy smoking. Brakes off, buddy. Quite honestly, this is a rather dangerous spot to be going fast, but <laughs> danger is my middle name, dude. I hate when semis and shit burn their brakes because it always makes me feel like my clutch is burning because of all of my sick ass downshifting and upshifting and. and shifting and, and shifting dude I love this bike so goddamn much mm. if this bike was a chick it'd be an 8 out of 10 wood bang if this bike were a drink it'd be the best goddamn rock star you've ever tasted in your life if this bike were a politician it would be the goddamn king of England no this bike isn't like the best bike in the whole world but Definitely my favorite. I've only ever ridden the R6, the S1000, this, and there's another one, but I can't remember what it was. So I don't have a whole lot of experience, but I definitely love this bike. Realistically, if this bike were a racehorse, it would be one of the ones that didn't come in last. <laughs> oh, Jesus.
All right, you guys, that's the video. Hope it was entertaining enough for you. See ya.